Hey guys, so this is a really random video for me. Uh, it's kind of just, I decided to sit down and talk to you a little bit, uh, mostly because of this new setting and the lighting and everything's new. I rearranged my room and this is the new background. That is if you approve. If you don't, I don't know what I'm gonna do because I don't have any other places in my room I can film. Basically, I wanted a change. I decided my videos, <sighs> Um, I don't know how to, ex I already explained this really eloquently and well, um, and then I realized my camera wasn't recording. I already filmed this video once. Lately I haven't been feeling like I've been putting in the effort that I know I can for my videos. Uh, I've been feeling quite lazy with my videos in both the editing and filming and setting up process. Even the content's been a little bit lazy, so I feel like I needed a change. Um, and so I asked you on Twitter what you wanted to see, majority of you, the biggest feedback I got was more interesting background. So this is what we got. Hopefully this is interesting enough for you. These clothes will change all the time, so you'll get constant, you know, variety of the background. Um, this will probably be a mess half the time, but I'm gonna try to do the effort and clean and make this look nice. But it's, it's not looking too good right now. It's dust city over here. And I'm looking a little rough right now, because I'm really sweaty. Uh, it's at the end of the day. Uh, it's like 7 p.m., so the lights, there's no light outside, so I'm using, you know, my artificial. Uh, hopefully this light works, though because that's why I bought it. But some of you said the lighting, you wanted better lighting, so hopefully this is good lighting. Uh, but I think during the day it'll be a lot better, because then I'll have the window, which is right in front of me, like over there, um, also on me, so it'll be, you know, extra bright. So those were the two feedbacks that I got the most. Also, shorter videos, which I don't know if I can promise that. I'm just a talker. Oh, I just spit really far, too. My videos tend to be quite long. A lot of you appreciate that. Some of you don't, apparently, so I'm gonna try to find an easy medium, you know? Maybe not make every video 20 minutes long, but a couple of them. So this video is basically asking for your feedback on what you wanted me to change in my videos, what kind of content you want me to create for you, uh, things like that. And the reason why I was so inspired to do this and, like, change... Granted, I'm not changing completely. I'm still myself. I'm still gonna talk about the things I love and not talk about the things I don't, like I'm not gonna do morning routines, you know. You know, I'm not gonna do videos that I don't feel have a purpose to me or are relevant to me, so, you know, but I will do, I will like introduce new things if you want um, that are, you know, things I still enjoy. Some of you may ask for more tutorials, which is a little scary because um, I do want to do like a series of tutorials based on hooded eyelids since I do have them and I know a lot of you guys do too. Uh, so I may do a series on that, like winged liner with hooded eyelids and things like that, because I think some of you would really benefit from that. Um, but otherwise, I'm not a makeup person. Like, I'm not a beauty guru. Um, I love makeup, but it's like I wear the same look every day, and I don't want people to think my tutorials are so repetitive. I'm not very creative. But I am doing lookbooks monthly, so hopefully there's more fashion injected into here, um, which I have been loving doing that. I've already started filming February's lookbook, and I've just been loving styling those outfits. Like... It's one of my passions to do lookbooks. It's tiring, but since it's so many looks for one month, it's like I can space out the filming of them. Of them. Um, but the styling part is like my favorite thing because I can literally just take the clothes I love and just put them together and they don't have to fit a theme like thrifted lookbook or winter lookbook. It can just be February lookbook and I can just put together any old outfit that I want. So I've been loving the variety of that. Let me know if you liked last month's or this month's lookbook. Um, what else? A couple people have inspired me. Well, basically just all the YouTubers I watch inspire me. Specifically, the, the whole reason that this was triggered, this change in me, was Rachel Nguyen or That Chic. Uh, she has a YouTube channel here, but she's also a fashion blogger. And um, I will have her channel listed down below. And I was watching her videos and they are unbelievable. I don't know how she only has like 12,000 subscribers. <laughs> watching her videos, it's like... I could do that, you know, I could put in that effort, not obviously exactly like her videos, but like, I could put in that effort, I could at least try harder, and like, you know, it's my job anyway, it's like, well not only is it my job, it's my passion, like I love, love doing these, and so I really want to spark that passion again, um, because I just have been dragging a lot lately for, you know, other reasons. Um, but some of it being that I feel like my, I've, I haven't been happy with the lighting and the backgrounds and the 
little bit of the content. I mean, some of it's been okay, but I feel like, yeah, I kind of half-assed some videos. That's a lot of the feedback I've been getting on Tumblr anonymously also. So people think that my video quality has gone down, which is so, you know, sad to hear, but I, I hear you. Like, I, I take it in and I really think about it. And it's not that it's harsh or anything. They haven't been mean um, by any means. So I, you know, genuinely take it in and I hear it. So thank you for being honest. So, I mean, I don't know how my videos have necessarily, ch I mean, obviously I change. I'm gonna have changes on my channel. I don't just sit in the same place for every single video for five years and look the same and talk about the same things. So there's going to be changes and things. I was in a rough patch there, I feel like, but now I want my videos to have a better quality. Uh, so the year of YouTube, let's get into that. This is the year, these are some big announcements. This is the year I get a nice camera. Now I have a Sony Cybershot, it's great, it's fine. Uh, it's broken, but it films in 1080. But I am gonna get a new camera, probably a Canon, something like that, um, you know, probably towards the middle of the year when I can actually afford it and don't have to pay taxes. <laughs> Also, this is the year of the meetup. I'm finally gonna do a meetup uh, in Northern California near Sacramento. So if you live near here, uh, stay tuned. That is technically free for me, so I don't need to have money saved up or anything. So we can just all go to the mall. So that's really exciting. And this is also the year that I get a P.O. box. I've decided I'm gonna get a P.O. box because so many of you ask if I have one and I have to be like, no, I don't. I think that would be so cool because so many of you wanna send me letters and stuff and I just would love that so I'm definitely gonna open one up this year so that is why this is the year of YouTube for me this is the year that I upgrade my camera I fix the background to something I like have better lighting and meet some of you guys in person and also open a P.O. box so I'm excited this is gonna be a big year for us all together hopefully you support the changes I'm sorry if you don't want them to change. I mean, I'm not, the content's not changing. I'm, I'm, well, not really. The stuff I normally do is not going away. Let's just say that. I'm going to be bringing new stuff into the picture, um, but my old stuff's not, you know, it's here to stay. And if anything, I'm gonna bring back old things, uh, like advice videos. Oh, we remember those. Yeah, psychology vlogs are coming back. Uh, I am gonna do a careers in psych video as a comeback, and then we'll focus on specific topics again. Um, I am furthering my education in it, so I feel like eventually I'm gonna come to a point where I'm, I can talk about issues that I don't personally deal with, so. I'm spitting a lot. Hopefully you guys are on board for that too. That's basically all I have to address in this video. This is a very random video and I'm sorry. I'm probably gonna try and upload it tonight just cause there's not much to edit in it. Um, and I really wanna hear your feedback. Like I'm so anxious. I just wanna know. I wanna know like what you guys wanna see and how you like this and how you like the lights. I cannot wait to show you how my room is arranged in my new room tour that I'll film probably in February. You guys should hold it, hold me to posting it in February, and if I don't, you better yell at me. Or at least continuously ask me on social media to post a room tour all throughout February until I actually do, because then it'll be so like pressuring that I have to do it. Make sure to annoy me on social media. I will have that link down below. Um, and, you know, talk to me on there too, and give me your feedback on the new changes of my channel, I guess. Also, thank you for 170,000 subscribers. I'm getting so close to 200,000. I never imagined I'd be even close to 200,000. It's weird, um, but that's also very exciting because this will be the year that I hit 200,000. So truly, it is the year of YouTube. That all being said, I hope you enjoy. Make sure to leave comments, suggestions, anything down below, and I will talk to you guys soon. Bye. It was the one thing I wanted. Oh my God, the scent is just phenomenal. Mm, mm, mm. And then this is also not mine. This is Calvin Klein Endless Euphoria.